There's a frustrating message that sometimes pops up when launching Grand Theft Auto V, an error occurred while authenticating with Rockstar Games services. It comes just as the game is about to start, and it stops every attempt to play. Behind the scenes, the game's launcher can't connect properly to the social club servers, so it refuses to move past the login check. Even though the internet connection might be fine, something in the chain between the PC and Rockstar's endpoints is breaking down. A lot of players have discovered that the culprit isn't always Windows or the router. In some cases, real-time protection in Windows security blocks the launcher's communication, so disabling that shield for a moment during login can clear the error. Others find that changing DNS settings to a public resolver, like Google's 8.8.8.8 and 8.8.4.4, helps the Rockstar launcher reach its servers more reliably. Completely removing and then reinstalling both the game and the launcher has worked when nothing else did. That means uninstalling the Rockstar Games launcher, the Epic Games or Steam integration, and even deleting the Rockstar Games folder in documents, then installing fresh. Starting the launcher as an administrator after that reset often lets the authentication finally go through. On Linux with Proton, there's a more unusual trick. Let the social club window appear and load until it seems frozen, then let it time out. Clicking retry or opening and then exiting the settings page a couple of times forces the launcher to finish its check. Once it has gone through settings and back out, the timeout actually unlocks the authentication and the game starts. Another handy tip comes from those using OneNote on Windows. Launching OneNote before starting RDR2 or GTA 5, then running the Rockstar launcher as admin, can stop a login freeze at the loading screen. It's odd, but having OneNote running seems to keep some Windows services from locking up the authentication module. When everything online fails, switching to the launcher without Steam or Epic integration can make a difference. Asking support for a direct Rockstar gift code removes the Steam login requirement altogether. With the game fully on Rockstar's own launcher, authentication goes through without Steam in the middle. Between antivirus tweaks, DNS swaps, fresh installs, folder deletions, and even OneNote workarounds, one of these approaches should push past the error occurred while authenticating wall. Persistence pays off, and once the launcher finally logs in, Los Santos and Blaine County are just a click away.